Loki season two is closer than ever, and the newly released trailer is a solid proof of that. October 6th will be a great day because we'll finally get to see our favorite god, Loki and his adventures with his allies. Now, let's take a look at the trailer first, then we can try to find some clues related to the first episode. Without further ado, let's begin. The beginning of the trailer shows us Loki and Mobius. It seems like Loki has a problem called time slipping. OB makes it clear that it's impossible to time slip in the TVA. But we all learned that TVA isn't as real as it seems, and it's actually a huge setup. So, I'm sorry, Obi, but almost anything is possible now. Then, we see Loki's narration. He says he's been pulled through time and he's in different locations as he suffers. It seems like he's been wandering between past and the present, and I know it sounds really bad, but it reminded me of his fall. I have been falling! For 30 minutes! So I couldn't keep my face straight, and I wonder if this guy will ever find peace? But anyways, let's go back to the trailer. We see that at some point, Loki even sees himself reading the TVA handbook or something. After that, he disrupts the illusion in TVA, and Kang's face appears. I believe in this season, Loki and Mobius will try to open TVA workers' eyes and show them the truth. Moving forward, Loki and Mobius travel in time, but this time, they're in old times. I'm not gonna lie, I love Loki's costumes in general, but he looks sharp in this outfit, don't you think? I wonder what they're up to. Are they trying to find the exact time when all these TVA scams started? Are they trying to stop Kang? In another shot, we see that this season gives us a promise of action once again. Loki even says that it's up to us to save this place. I know he's a god of mischief, but he always did his best when necessary, so I believe this time won't be any different, and he will do anything he can, of course, with Mobius's and Sylvie's help. Rest of the trailer shows us how things will get complicated, and how Sylvie and Loki will try to fix everything standing side by side. I believe this adventure will provide love, action, tension, and confusion. That's why I believe season two will be so much better than the previous one. Don't get me wrong, I love the first season, but I've always believed that this show has the capacity of offering more. Now, it's time to talk about the first episode. As you may remember, the ending of the first season showed us that Loki is now in a different timeline, and nobody from the TVA recognizes him. I believe the first episode of season two will take over where we were left, and we'll see Loki trying to convince Mobius about what happened. They built a friendship once, and they can do it again. But things are even more complicated now, so I don't think this will be an easy task to achieve. Most importantly, I don't think Loki will try to go back to the previous timeline. Because if you look closely, you can see the cut on his arm, and it was there in the latest episode. So it's safe to say that Loki will suddenly experience time slipping, and Mobius will take him to Obi to find a solution. In this scene, we see Loki ending up in front of jet skis. And you know who loves jet skis, right? It's no other than Mobius. I believe he may continue his adventure with Mobius in this timeline. It's probably his mortal life before ending up in the TVA. What do you think? Even though Loki keeps slipping in time, we may at least get to see Mobius's early life, and I believe it would be amazing. You know what this means, right? This time slipping doesn't take Loki to random places, but it provides him different settings with people he already knows. Those are the people who may play an important role in these chaotic series of incidents. Later in the preview, we see Sylvie working at McDonald's, and I believe Loki will find her in the first episode. I believe that because it seems like he'll be visiting lots of timelines and places, so finding Sylvie wouldn't be the most challenging thing. Overall, I believe the first episode will provide us with a context, and it will show how Loki will find allies. We'll see a forming group to fight in the first episode so that the action may finally begin for the rest of the season. These are all my predictions considering the trailer. What do you think will happen in the first episode of season two? Do you think Loki will manage to wake people up from the illusion they've been exposed to? Let me know in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video, hit the like button and share it with your friends. You can also subscribe to my channel for more videos like this one. Thanks for watching. See you soon.